Okay, it's Monday morning, my least favorite day of the week, Monday, and it's 9 a.m. And today I'm gonna take uh, my remote pilot SUAS uh, license test to uh, become a commercial drone pilot. So I've been studying uh, like crazy and uh, I got about two and a half hours before I have to leave and uh, my test is at 1 p.m. So I'm going to be studying until I, uh, until I have to leave. There's really a lot to know. It's a lot of map reading uh, stuff I didn't know anything about until I started doing this studying. Uh, airport operations, national airspace, weather. Uh, you know, it's... Hopefully I, uh, I pass. Uh, you test the 60 questions and uh, you're allowed to get 18 wrong. That would be a 70%. So, got my fingers crossed that uh, I come out of this uh, alive. It's uh, 150 bucks to take the test. So, failing is not uh, desired. But, not feeling all that great about it. Uh, pretty nervous. Some of the stuff is pretty complicated. Especially the national airspace. And uh, figuring out floors and ceilings of uh, the airspace, I mean, I don't know, it's, I guess it's simple if you know what you're doing, I'm still new at it, so it's a bit overwhelming and complicated to me, but I've been studying, so we'll see what happens. Alright, it's 11.30 a.m. and it's time to head out to Queens for this test. Uh, I'm going to catch the B train to 42nd Street, then catch, then catch the 7 train to, uh, 40th Street, Queens, and walk the six blocks to where I need to go. Hopefully I pass this thing. So uh, here we go. Now, it's been warm in New York the past couple of weeks, but man, it got cold yesterday and today. Very cold. Queens now, a few blocks from the test site, and I'm running late. The subway just stopped in the tube that B train did for like 10 minutes, and I just stood there, so running late. This is the test site. All right, I passed my test. I got an 83%, so I'm stoked about that. And uh, heading back to Brooklyn. All right, to anyone out there that needs a commercial drone pilot, I am now available. Contact me.
All right, made it back to Brooklyn and uh, walking down my street now. I actually have to go move my car. It's a game we play in New York City with street cleaning. So I decided I'm not moving my car at the moment because there's no parking spots in this neighborhood at all and there's just people driving around looking for spots. So I am not gonna move it at the moment. I gotta move it by tomorrow at 9 a.m. So I'm in the Tuesday 9 a.m. street cleaning spot and my car is right there. So I just found out there was a recall on uh, Sierra Nevada beer. So if you uh, bought any beer that was bottled between December 5th of 2016 and January 13th of 2017, uh, you can take it back and get your money back. Um, I've been drinking uh, the Torpedo like crazy and uh, I got a whole bunch right here. And uh... The recall is for uh, weak bottles. Uh, apparently, they, uh, one out of 10,000 bottles could chip a piece of glass and you could drink glass and God knows what's gonna happen if you do that. So uh, check it out and uh, get your money back for those cases of beer. I think I'm gonna make an egg sandwich with a little bit of fried salami. Now that is a good looking sandwich. Delicious.